What's up, YouTube? Uh, sitting in my car, I just picked up a lot of pops that I bought. Uh, most for possible trade bait. We'll see. Um, I know I don't want all of them, but I got them at a decent price. So uh, we'll, we'll see uh, if anybody's interested in them at some point. So first one, Captain Marvel, Hot Topic exclusive. She's got her hand on her hip. So that's the normal Captain Marvel. And this is a slight variation. She's got her hand on her hip. It's a Hot Topic exclusive. Box looks good. So there's that one. Of course, I couldn't wait till I got home to do this because I'd be out trash picking tonight anyway. So oh, it falls over. Hopefully, it's still fine. I got this one, it's a Star Wars. It's pretty cool. When I looked it up, I guess I don't know if it's too new or what the deal is. It's that's it looks fine. Um, it's a Target only exclusive. It's Baby Nippet Flocked. So I guess it's a uh, fuzzy. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this one yet. I'm gonna save it for now and see what we do with it later. Uh, pretty fucking cool there's no price on it yet so that's why i assumed if it's new but for now that's a keeper or at least hold on to it uh, this one i got for myself um sorry i don't even know what i'm looking at Either way, this one I got for myself, for my Hulk. It's Bruce Banner. It's cool because he's starting to turn green. You can see in the fingers. I didn't realize it was on the head also until I got it. But when I saw the picture online, I knew the fingers were green. So that's what I thought was pretty cool about it. Um, he's not the Hulk yet, but he's going to be the Hulk. So that's why I like that one because he's turning green. Uh, the guy threw this in for free. He said he had no use for the magnets. He knows I like Batman and the Joker. So I got that for free. That's pretty fucking cool. I don't have any use for magnets per se, but it's free and it's Batman and Joker. So I don't care. Um, this one's cheap, but it's pretty fucking cool. I've never seen it. Again, I'm new to this stuff, so I don't even know how old it is. Uh, I don't know. Either way, Snowman Jack. So the figure's pretty fucking cool, I thought. Uh, but it's still relatively cheap. Uh, but I figure, what the hell? There's cheap Batmans out there. Never know what you can use for trade. We got this one, Marvel vs. Capcom, Capcom, it's Gamora and vs. Strider, it's pretty fucking cool, it's an FYE exclusive, so that one's legit, uh, this one I got for myself, because it's Batman, Batman vs. the Penguin. Target only. Uh, Penguin might be for trade. I will probably take it out of box because that's what I do with the ones I collect for the most part. Uh, I might keep it in box, but I just don't get any satisfaction out of it being inside the box. Not that I really get satisfaction of it being outside the box, but or I'll just keep it because it's a set. I don't know. I can't really trade the penguin and then just leave the Batman, I guess. Then I got this one because it was pretty fucking awesome. It's not necessarily my cup of tea, but I figure at worst I could trade it for something cool. It's a hot topic exclusive. It's lock, shock, and barrel. 
This thing's fucking massive. It's fucking huge. <laughs> but it's pretty fucking cool. So, there's that. So, if you are interested in any of them, hit me up. And uh, maybe we can trade. Like I said, Batman, Joker, uh, Harley Quinn, Darth Vader, Spider-Man, and uh, Deadpool is kind of what I'm looking for. Doesn't mean I won't take other stuff if I just think it's cool or not, whatnot, but like, I don't mind keeping this. It's just not necessarily where I'm going to go with my collection. Meanwhile, I just picked up two Nightmare Before Christmas pieces. Anyways, I know they're Disney. I know some people like them, so they are for trade. Thanks for watching, and uh, that's about it for now. I'm going to go uh, trash picking. Look for some metal. Later.